What's going on YouTube? This is SG1 Sports and it's time for our week five picks on our college football pick'em game. I have updated the leaderboard, so I'll be showing that here in the in the first part of the video, and then we'll get to our picks. And as far as the leaderboard goes, uh, if you've missed a couple of weeks or if you're just now starting, I'm sorry, but I'm not gonna be including you on there because I just I don't have time to do you know keep adding people. The list will just keep getting longer of all these people that don't even play anymore. So uh, just gonna keep about the top 50 or so on the leaderboard. This is the last, you know, I didn't show the, the leaderboard last week, so after after week three, this is how it looked. Uh, you can see we've got four of us tied for number one, including me, Cedric Granger in there as well, the winner from last year. He's looking to repeat. Uh, that would be quite a feat right there. Uh, so that's the leaderboard, you know, before this past week. Uh, and then last week, here's the best scores from last week. So even if you don't get on the leaderboard because you've missed some weeks, uh, you still may show up on my videos. Uh, if you have the best week that week so you can still play you know for that even though you may not have a chance to win you know the whole thing so this is last week's i think i had 60 points so i didn't quite make it on here uh looks like cedric granger did not either uh, but these are the updated standings the the top here of of everybody after week four so this is the current standings uh, you can see there are three of us still tied for number one including myself cedric granger dropped to four uh, whatever to watch is at six. He was one of the best players from last year. And a lot of these are new new names, new faces here that didn't play last year. But these are the top players so far. The, and we'll have, you know, again, the top 50 or so on the website if you want to check out that leaderboard. Okay, so let's get to the picks this week. We got South Carolina at Texas A&M. That should be a, a pretty good matchup there. Texas A&M favored uh, in that one. Florida State against Wake Forest. This one's on my upset alert video. I definitely think Wake Forest has a chance. Will I pick them? Probably not. Uh, I do think Florida State's the better team. Uh, but, you know, I haven't decided on my picks yet. I usually wait until Saturday morning and I do my picks. Uh, North Carolina at Georgia Tech. I think Georgia Tech will be able to handle this one. I definitely am going with them. I've already told you guys I like Iowa over Michigan State, even on the road. Uh, Colorado at UCLA. That'll be a, a toss-up. I think that's going to be a close one. UCLA's playing at home, so might give them the nod, but uh, I still haven't decided on that one either. Here we go now, the rest of the games. Vanderbilt at Florida. Uh, Vanderbilt was really exposed last week against Alabama. We'll see how they bounce back in this one. Uh, Georgia at Tennessee, another game on my upset alert video. Tennessee playing at home. Don't sleep on them. I think they got a chance in this one. Mississippi State at Auburn. I really like Auburn to win this one at home, but Mississippi State, we'll see. Are we going to get Mississippi State that we saw against Georgia or the one we saw against LSU? And Auburn, are we going to get the team we saw against Missouri or the one we saw against Clemson? That's the big question there. Oklahoma State at Texas Tech and probably the most high-scoring game of the weekend. That one's going to be a lot of fun to watch. And then Clemson at Virginia Tech, game of the week. Who do you like in that one? Clemson, obviously the favorite, but I think it could go either way. So our bonus picks this week. We're going to go with how many total yards will Saquon Barkley have versus Iowa. And that says Iowa, but it should say Indiana. I guess I had last week on my mind. Um, I just now realized that. But, yeah, uh, they don't play Iowa. They play Indiana. This is not – don't give me the number from last week. This should say Indiana. Again, sorry about that. On the website, I'm, I'll have it fixed to say Indiana. And that includes his return yardage, kickoff returns, uh, as well so any kind of yardage he has will be included what do you think the total will be and then what will be the winning margin of alabama over old miss so if you think they're going to win by 28 points you'd put 28 um and i forgot to mention we had someone last week uh sawyer 97 or i can't remember his name for sure but he got both bonus picks and he got one of them exactly right so he got 25 points in bonus picks Unfortunately, he had a horrible week as far as picking the games go. So you didn't even see him on the highest picks from last week. Because I think he only got maybe three out of the ten picks for a total score of 55. That's why I didn't mention him. Sorry about that. But, yeah, that was crazy that he got both bonus picks and got one exactly right. I'll, I will bet that somebody's going to get this Alabama one exactly right. Uh, you know, because that's going to be a lower number. It's not going to be up in the hundreds like some of our other bonus picks. So, yeah, I think somebody does get that one exactly right. We'll see who it is. Um, I don't know. I really am, am, kind of, am kind of torn on that game. I don't know how it's going to go. I definitely like Alabama pretty big, um, but I haven't quite got a number yet on that one. So there you go. That's the picks for this week. Link down in the description below. Go ahead and click that link. 
make your picks and make sure you use the exact same username that you have used all season long if you're new um you will be featured on the video next week if you get a top score for the week but unfortunately the leaderboard is not going to be updated for new people because you just be so far behind that i'm not gonna you know waste time doing that so that's it thanks for watching good luck on your picks and stay tuned for more here on the sg1 sports youtube channel